So today we're going to continue our discussion about microphones. First we saw whether to use a USB microphone or an XLR microphone. Now we're going to talk about whether you need a dynamic microphone or a condenser microphone. Dynamic microphones are great for singing. They just sound really good when you're belting into them. The thing about dynamic microphones is that you're going to have to plug them not only in an external audio interface, you're also going to need extra preamplification. Your external audio interface has preamplification in it, but it's not quite enough for a dynamic microphone. You need more power. So think about that. You're just going to need like the mic and audio interface plus a preamp. Condenser microphones are typical studio microphones for voiceovers. They're just the norm. They're what most commercial studios use, most voice talent use. Um, they sound great because they really are sensitive and pick up all the nuances and the subtleties in your voice and they just like pick up all the richness and you don't need that extra preamp. You can just plug them into an external audio interface and voila, you're done. You sound like a million bucks. That said, high-end condenser microphones like this one, uh, Neumann, this is my Neumann, they, like a Neumann or uh, let's say Neumann, my Neumann, um, and an AKG, they sound really good also if you plug them into a preamp. You know, they shine, they, they'll, they'll sound really good. So you can use your mic plus your audio interface plus a preamp as well with higher-end condenser microphones, but it's not necessary. That's the difference. And honestly, that's pretty much it. Um, so I recommend for voiceovers that you use a condenser. If you're a singer and you have a great dynamic microphone, don't sweat it. Just use it. You just might need a preamp to actually do um, voiceovers. One of my first microphones was a dynamic microphone, and I loved it. Everybody loved it. I got so many compliments on my, about my voice when I had that mic. I never really had that many compliments since, to be honest. So there's no rule. It's just a little bit easier on the wallet if you start with a condenser microphone. If you have any questions or comments, please write them in the comment section and I'll do my best to answer them as cleverly as I can.